it's your girl, a girl can Mac, coming at you to talk about uh, my twist challenge update. So, this video is going to be not edited because this camera is a really lovely camera, but it's an MPEG-4, this MPEG-4 video file, and stupid, uh, you know, Windows movie maker doesn't support this and I'm always I'm trying to find the software for these codecs or whatever it is to be able to transfer it but I haven't had any success and I was doing some videos through through a bunch of media but I don't like the quality it takes away from the quality of the original videos that I make so I'm trying to I guess I'm gonna try to find some video editing software that won't take me to the bank, that won't empty my bank account, that I can use to edit the videos. So until then, I'm just going to kind of have to work with this because I don't, that one true media messes up the quality and like for HD, for it actually to be like the real quality of these videos, you have to, you have to pay and I would rather just buy software than pay them every month for something that I could just pay a one-time fee. But. I digress. Let's get back to the topic at hand. Okay, so this is week three in these tiny twists, and you guys, I'm ready to take them out. They gotta go. My scalp is itching like crazy, and my hair feels dirty. I just, I don't think my hair, I can go more than, I can't go more than two weeks without washing it. And I know with these, I know that they will they'll come undone definitely that's just the kind of hair that I have even when I wash my hair in sections I have to braid I can't twist because if I twist they'll come undone and it would just be a big old mess but I can't do it I cannot do it and I was gonna redo the front and the sides to get me to the last week the fourth week but it's not happening and I'm okay with that you live and you learn so what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna take them out on Friday See, it's itching. And my scalp is getting flaky. It's, it's build up, but I can't I can't deal with it. And I can't I can't wash my hair with these in and I don't I don't like that. So two weeks is enough for me. What I'm also learning on this challenge is oh yes. So I never really quite figured out the best way to moisturize these tiny twists. I did try different methods. I tried castor oil and I didn't like that. It just, I don't like, I didn't like it on my twisted hair. I like it when my hair is loose and I'm moisturizing and sealing, but not with this. So I tried that. Then I tried moisturizing with the shea pudding that I made, that I twisted the hair with. But I didn't like that and I feel like that's part of the reason why I have build up because the original recipe, the aloe vera gel I used, it's not 100% natural, and it just, I just feel gummy. It feels really weird, so I think that's part of it. So I didn't like moisturizing with that. Then I tried, last week, I tried just lightly misting on my usual moisturizing mist, and they shrunk up a little bit. So what I did to stretch them back out is I... I put them in large braids like I would do a braid out, but I just did on the twist, and that stretched it back out. But I don't think that the mist is the answer. Even though it felt good, I, just, I don't think that's the answer either. So then I came up with the idea that I probably just need a cream. I need some kind of like cream or a thick lotion to kind of lightly just put on, which I haven't found yet. And I'm learning that my hair just doesn't really care for glycerin just doesn't and it's really hard for me to find a moisturizing hair cream that does not have glycerin in it so I guess that's another one for the mixtures chronicles I'm gonna have to play around and make my own cream that has no glycerin in it because my hair just it just seems like it doesn't like it anymore I liked it a lot when I had a TWA but now that my hair is growing out of that it, does, it doesn't like products with glycerin in it, it always feels moisturized like at first and then it dries out so that's what I came up with for as far as my moisturizing goes and all that yada yada so you can see I, I have a little updo here and I have I'll turn around so you can see I use the 
hope you can see it good. Yeah, I think that's what was that. It's the those easy combs. So they're they're fun to play around with these, and I pinned them up a couple different ones. I didn't really experiment too too much. I just didn't feel like it. So that's that. So when I take them out, I am gonna take a one week hiatus from the challenge because I need to trim my hair and I'm going to straighten my hair for the first time and I know I may have said in some other videos that I wasn't interested but lately curiosity is getting the best of me so I want to see what it looks like but the way that I'm going to straighten my hair is I'm not going to use any heat so some of you probably know how I'm going to do it and others of you may not but I'm going to do a video on it so you will see how, I, how I'm going to do it and I think that's it. So I'm just going to do that for a week, trim my ends really good, and then I will go back and finish out the challenge. But I'm really thinking that I might do braids instead because I like having them this small and the versatility that you get, but I can't, I can't keep them in, obviously, for more than two, three weeks. My scalp just ain't having it. So I think I'm going to do small braids the side of these twists and that way I can wash my hair in them because when you braid it it doesn't if it does shrink it doesn't shrink up as much so I'll be able to wash my scalp and it'll cut down on the frizz and all that good stuff so I think that's it for my update I hope I didn't ramble too much and bore you guys and I also want to give a shout out to sweet ma for life congratulations on your BC miss welcome to the kinky curly land and I'm so excited for you, and if you have any questions or if I can help in any way, then definitely holla at your girl. And you guys definitely check out her channel because she makes some really cool videos, and some are really funny. She's very entertaining, so check her out. And that's it, guys. Peace out. Stay naturally fly, and hopefully the next time I see you, I will have found some kind of software that I can video, that I can edit these videos with that doesn't cost me an arm and a leg. If you know of any, give me some suggestions. I definitely appreciate it. Alright guys, bye-bye.